an ordinary life can be extraordinary. There is beauty in imperfections, and magic can be found in the mundane. My kitchen, a little place where I feel I belong, and I know that may be absurd to most. It's not popular or trendy by any means, especially this day and age. Being graceful, being gentle, empathetic, and to embrace humility is often associated with weakness, but that's incredibly untrue. True femininity requires strength, courage, and perseverance. The kitchen can be a wonderful place to create. I love exploring old cookbooks, discovering new spices and flavors from faraway lands, and that's exactly what I'm doing today. I'm taking you on a culinary trip to the Middle East and making chicken biryani with dried apricots, pomegranate salad with fresh herbs and pistachios, and for dessert, I'll be making Persian rice pudding with rose and cardamom. So as always, my sweet friend, I'm really glad you're here with me today, and I've stopped by for a visit at our little cottage kitchen on the northern plains of Iowa. spices sautéing in the pan are not only perfuming this little cottage kitchen, but also providing comfort. The kitchen is truly the hearth of the home, a place of creation, a place of nourishment, a place to gather with loved ones. And you can travel anywhere in the kitchen. You can grab your old Italian cookbook and create linguine with clams and fresh basil while sipping on a glass of red wine and listening to Fanny Torricella. 
and even reading a book to learn Italian at night. There's so many joys to be had in the kitchen. Just begin creating.
Bye.